Gordon Parks was one of the greatest African-American men of the 20th century. He paved the way for so many visionaries, not only photographers, but filmmakers and writers. You know, he gave us hope and possibility. He showed me the, the power of, of the camera and how the, the camera could be used and the pen as a weapon to affect change. He captured the elegance of black life. He didn't create it. He bore witness to it, he experienced it, and he captured it. His work asks you to question your own eyes, your own lens. Why do you look at that same thing and not see beauty? And I think that's what he challenged people to do in his work. Gordon was one of those things that shifted the culture, and he made people pay attention to my community. When you look at all the accolades, the work, even down to the point I loved his heart and how he moved and how he gave back, he made me what I am today. He just was an incredible artist. He had a great understanding of light and composition. And not only was he a photographer and, and, and a filmmaker, but he was a historian. He was able to document both the poor and the rich. You know, he was a poet, he was a musician, he was a director. He was a, you know, a Renaissance man in every sense. The nature of the many disciplines and tools he was using, um, you know, photography, he was writing books, he was making movies, I mean, he was doing it all. And to make something as lyrical and intimate as The Learning Tree, and then, you know, create a cultural phenomenon like Shaft um, from the same filmmaker, uh, untrained um, in the ways of, you know, the white man's ways of Hollywood, is remarkable when you think about it. He's one of the few that was brave enough to do it and try something different. Gordon Parks was truly a visionary, and in 2006, as he was getting older, he wanted to leave an even stronger foundation, an institution that will preserve his legacy at the same time, through the works, create funds that could help facilitate uh, educational opportunities for young people in the field of photography, filmmaking, writing, uh, journalism, and, and music. His legacy continues on through this new generation of visionaries. You gotta think of his legacy is already it's constantly folding on itself. They've taken my career to a whole nother level. And, and then me, I'm gonna birth something else. If a kid's into photography, I'm gonna find a way to activate it because I know what it did for me. Going past to the day, he's no longer here, but he's still saving lives and also cultivating spaces. It's still a lot of work that has to be done. But I do feel that Gordon would be really happy to know that his voice continues to inspire so many young people in his passing. You know, he still serves as a light. His work wasn't for naught. It's making a big difference.